Yo guys, what is going on? It is your boy. Guys, I know this is a lot of top 100 rewards, but it's a big week. So a lot of the guys that I'm boys with and watch the stream were like, yo, I have top 100. Let's do them, right? It's a big week with all these ultimate team of the season players. Obviously, so many, so many expensive players and packs. I'm actually over on Xbox right now. I'm on my boy Doofman's account. I'll link his link in the description. The man is from New York, so a native, a brother. Um, but we got to get him something good today. He has a fantastic record. This is the guy that, honestly, his team, I don't know if he's upgraded his team a lot. His team a few weeks ago wasn't that good. It's definitely better. I don't know if this is like the current team that he's rocking out with. I don't know what he's doing. If he has a concept, he doesn't. So like, this is like all he has right now. Um, Donnarumma net. He's got, he just finished Blanc and Maldini really recently. I'm assuming Vieira probably has a good amount of games. So it looks like he's just made that change to Team of the Seasons. Aguero's got a good amount of goals. He's probably just made that step up now to Team of the Season cards for his starting 11. Um, but as you guys can see, looking through his club, he does need it. Like, we could use some good reds today. We could use some good stuff. In terms of untradables, he only has Bernardo Silva. So this is big for him, man. This is going to be a big reward set. Um, I believe when I spoke to him, he, was, he finished 27th in the world. Um, so I have him on standby for the player picks just so we if we have any confusion so the 27th in the world or 25th wherever he finished i'll double check right now 27th in the world on xbox so what this means is that he's going to get five player picks which is pretty big that's a lot of player picks and there's a lot of opportunity for him to get something pretty good um we are looking for one usable red for his starting 11 that is all i ask ea sports for okay the reds have not been great i think center backs are tough because I don't know. I think if he got Van Dyke, he may have to reconsider keeping Blanc in the starting 11. Um, but I think we're going to be looking for like, you know, a Havertz, a Royce. Some of those kind of players in terms of what he has in his team look like they would work really well. I don't think he would mind a Sterling at all. And definitely looking at his bench, the super subs could all be better. So we're going to start with player pick Numar 1. And it's going to be Allison. Now that's not good because he has Donnarumma in net. And I think he's going to be a Donnarumma over Allison kind of guy. So that's not a great first player pick. Obviously, we'll get a bad one out of the way. That's fine. At least he stays high rated with it. At least it stays 95 rated. Quaglarella. I'm going to take Quaglarella over Oblak. Even though I think Quaglarella has a higher chance of popping out again than Oblak, I, don't, I, I can't stand taking another keeper. I'm not sure if he's going to use this. Medium, medium, four star, four star. It's a decent card. He may end up trying out this card. I think Quaglarella, I don't know if he's on the market. What's his value on the market? I've got Xbox prices up now for you guys so we can do this legit 169k. So we've got 169k for Quagliarella. We'll end up choosing him. So we've got two players from the Ultimate so far that are decent. The middle pick is going to be Oblak. Uh, we'll end up taking Oblak because he's the highest rated for SBCs. So really, I mean, we've got two keepers so far and not really like a full-on usable one. Of course, Allison's going to pop out again. Uh, now it's coming down to the decision of... Are we going to want to take this guy or this guy in terms of like fullbacks? I don't really think he cares too much. I'll just take this guy because his in-games look a little better. Okay, EA, this is the last red. Can you guys please give us something good here? Because these reds have not been great. Please give us something good, EA, please. Oh my god, EA Sports, let's go. Bro. That is massive. I'm telling you right now, I think he's going to be really happy. Let's go, man. Five-star weak foot, Red Havertz. Welcome to the club. Six foot two. Right now on this market, he is 1.67 million. Jeez, man. 97 jumping, 94 stamina, 97 hanging accuracy, uh, 85 strength. Doesn't matter. He's a very good card. Very, very good card. That's big. He's going to be really happy with that. So that that's kind of saved the Reds because the Reds were tragic until that point. And then we hit Havertz. So I'm very happy about that. That is very, 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 very good. Um, and yeah. So now we've got all these tradable packs, untradable packs. We've got some rivals, I think, rewards. And then obviously, guys, we've got that big boy pack at the end. That's kind of like, that's kind of the make or break. That's the big, that's the big thing, boys. That pack at the end, I'm starting to get a little nervous for. He's also got the 300Ks, and we've got, obviously, a lot in packs right now. So I'm not going to sit here and say that there's not going to be a chance that we, we we could potentially get something crazy in those. Um, that is for sure. Um, so that's very good. 
Uh, yeah, he's hyped about Havertz. He's so hyped. And Havertz, to a lot of pros, guys, is one of the most meta players in the game. So I'm assuming he was looking into probably using him anyways. I think you. I think if you get that kind of card, you're going to use him. Um, so very happy for him in that regard because it is a really good feeling, guys, to have a red that you know you're going to put in your starting eleven. And looking at his team, he's gonna. He's got the Costa. That's the thing. So he has red the Costa, which tells me that he's probably going to put Havertz as a CDM and give that give that some chemistry and probably end up doing that, which is really 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 good. I'm very happy about that. Lacazette in the last pack. We'll take the coins here. Uh, and then we'll discard the rest here. Now we're moving into kind of some of the, the real packs, guys. We've got three 100,000 coin packs. The question is, is EA going to give us a walkout uh, at all in these 100k packs? Because I haven't seen it so far. We get Colombian striker that's going to be Falcao, which is an 85 rated. Um, not too good. Dude, I was thinking about this the other day. I want the walkout thing back from the old FIFA guys. You know when FIFA 17, when that thing, right, I would open this pack and boom, it just stopped. I want that, bro. I want that back in my life, dude. It's brutal, man. It's brutal without it. You just know, bro, you had a hope. You had a, a distant thing that was going on that you were like, you know what? I'm going to hit something amazing. Uh, we got an inform in the next 100K pack. Obviously, nothing crazy, nothing to really, really, really go nuts over. Uh, I guess I'll just send the rest. We'll discard the rest. I don't think he's going to do much with any of those. Last 100k pack. If we're going to get a walkout on any of these 100k packs, we're not. So three 100k packs with no walkout. We want to say thank you so much, EA. Thank you, EA, for the for the pack look. Now, maybe that's going to mean that his next pack is going to be ridiculous. I'm not sure. Okay, I'm not sure, but I'm hoping. Um, guys, the worst you can make on Xbox right now in the, in the Ultimate Team of the Season guaranteed pack, the absolute worst that you can make... I think it's 4.5 million looking at it. If we hit somebody big, the pack's instantly like five and a half mil. So the pack drastically changes if we hit something big. Obviously, this is a big week for, for him, right? Like he can use a lot of coins to upgrade the squad. This is going to be the week where he's deciding, is he going to be putting in a Ronaldo or is he going to be settling and maybe just having to end up doing like a Royce and a Havert situation? That's going to be a big deal for him, man. So I really want to try to make him a lot of coins out of this pack. We're going to go ahead, guys. We're going to open it up. What we're going to do, as I've said before, I like to open it up and I like to let it sit. I like to, that's been my new thing with these, when we've been doing top 100 rewards. I like to let it sit. We've had some very, very good pack luck already doing it that way. So we're going to continue doing it that way. So we're going to go ahead, open this up in three, two, one. Let's get this thing open. Come on, man. Give us Ronaldo. Give us Messi. Give us a, you know what? We want to see a high rated guys, just for the chance to have a lot of other stuff in the pack. That's the, that's the goal here. Portuguese. Oh my God. Let's go, man. Ronaldo. Oh, my God, bro. He's going to go ape, bro. I'm typing him right now. He's going to go crazy. Let's go, man. Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, my Lord. We packed CR7, bro. Man, is that mad. Oh, my God. My, oh, my God. Let's go, man. He's going crazy. I'm going to send him a picture real quick. I love this whole thing about having these guys in the DM, bro, because it's so like, they're like on edge, bro, about what you get. Uh, let's go, man. 99 Ronaldo in the top 100 pack. So on Xbox right now, he sells for 6.68 million. And because he's a 99 rated, there is a very, very large chance that there is other stuff in this pack. Um, that is a very, very likely situation. So I'm super, super stoked for the guy. He's going to make a ton of team upgrades. He might actually keep this because it's first owner. I told you guys how we're going to, we're going to let this pack sit. It's going to chill and that's how we're going to do it. So I'm going to let it roll into whatever we get next. I would be, this would be crazy. If he hits like another 98 in this pack, that would be crazy. What we were looking for is like a Havertz or a Royce to add, probably to make it like eight, eight and a half mil. If we get one of those, this pack is going to be 10 million coins. Koulibaly, Pepe. Okay. So his pack was really, okay. His pack was amazing, right? Because he got Ronaldo. Outside of Ronaldo, his pack was pretty poor because there's only one other player in here that's going to sell above 500,000 coins. And that's going to be Pepe. So we're going to go look, guys, right now. I'm going to add it up. So Ronaldo, right? 6.6 .6 mil. We already looked at that. Koulibaly is 300K. So it's going to make it 6.9. Pepe would make it. He's 800K. So Pepe makes it about like 7.6, 7, we'll say 7.7. 7. Quag makes it about, let's say, 8 mil. This guy makes it 8.1. This guy makes it 8.2, 8.3, 8.4, 8.5, 8.6, 8.7, 8.8, 8.9, 8.10, 8.11, 8.12, 8.13, 8.14, 8.
eight three, about eight five, eight six, eight eight, about nine. So we've got nine million coins in this pack from these rewards, which is fantastic. And he's got Cristiano Ronaldo, which is the even more uh, important thing. He's got Cristiano Ronaldo in the squad, ready to go. So he's walked away from these top 100 rewards, boys, with a Red Havertz, um, a Red Havertz to go right into his team. So he's not going to have to buy four players for his team. He's only going to have to buy three. He's also gone ahead and he's packed a Cristiano Ronaldo, which means that he may not end up selling that card. So he's got essentially minus the six mil off the nine. He's going to have four and a half million, five million, six million ish to go ahead and fill up two other positions in his team. Um, absolutely fantastic, man. Couldn't be happier for the guy. Um, really, 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 really good rewards. Um, very happy to get this for him, man. This is one of my, my boys, bro. Like, honestly, I know this guy since FIFA 17. So very good to see great rewards for him. Guys, if you enjoyed the video today, just drop a thumbs up. Crazy top 100 rewards, man. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. A lot of Ronaldo's being packed. So love to see it. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys soon. Peace.